Princess Beatrice is a summer queen in head-to-toe linen and Chanel heels. We're used to seeing the royal family wearing smart coat dresses and serious dark colors, so when Princess Beatrice made a surprise appearance in Switzerland this week, dressed in the ultimate summer ensemble, we sat up and took notice. The 35-year-old was in Geneva for the Air for Good Summit, opting to wear head-to-toe linen for the occasion, accessorized with classic Chanel slingbacks. Welcome to Royal Pancakes. If you are new here, please don't forget to subscribe and click the notifications bell, so you don't miss any news about the British monarchy. Beatrice's ensemble was perfect for the weather in Geneva, as while we're knocking on the door of June, meaning linen is on our fashion agenda, there's certainly still a nip in the air, so her choice of a long-sleeved linen jacket and midi skirt was a smart one. The Chanel slingbacks added an elegant touch to Beatrice's ensemble, proving she meant business for the event, which saw her take to the stage to discuss how air can have a positive impact. The royal appeared on stage, expressing her desire to use AI for good, watch a clip of her speech below to see what she had to say on the topic. While Beatrice was engaging in a serious discussion during her trip to Geneva, the princess was having bundles of fun last weekend on a trip to Monaco, which saw her partying with her cousin, Zara Tyndall, and their mutual friend, TV presenter Natalie Pinkham. Princess Beatrice planted a kiss on her cousin's cheek, a rare show of affection among the notoriously stoic royals. Proving linen is a favorite fabric, Princess Beatrice wore a lightweight white linen dress while in Monaco, topped with an ultra-casual denim jacket, showing that she aces low-key fashion just as much as business wear. The denim jacket is clearly a current favorite in Beatrice's wardrobe, as she also shrugged in on last week during a visit to a primary school in London, this time opting to wear it over a belted floral midi dress. If you feel like you're seeing more of Princess Beatrice right now, you'd be right. The royal has been stepping up to help her uncle, King Charles, and her cousin, Prince William, while Charles and Princess Kate undergo cancer treatment. Last week, Beatrice attended a garden party at Buckingham Palace, hello. Understands Beatrice and her sister, Princess Eugenie, were drafted in to help out because of the unique circumstances Prince William is facing as his wife the princess continues to focus on her recovery from cancer. While Eugenie and Beatrice are making more public appearances of late, they don't receive public funding for their activities or security, in line with other non-senior working royals. Princess Eugenie is one proud mother as she marked her little boy Ernest's first birthday on Thursday. Taking to her personal Instagram page, the royal, 34, marked her son's milestone by sharing some sweet family snaps. The photographs showed Ernest dressed in a personalized blue football kit with his nickname Ernie on the back of the shirt, as well as the tot having fun at a playgroup and enjoying an Easter egg hunt. The last snap showed big brother August, 3, kissing his little brother, Ernest, as the youngsters enjoyed a day out at the Natural History Museum in London. One year of you my dear Ernest. Happy birthday. We all love you so much, especially your enormous smile you give the world, but you always save an extra special one for mama. Triple X, Eugenie wrote in the caption. The princess announced that she and husband, Jack Brooksbank, had welcomed the arrival of their second son five days after his birth in June 2023. Sharing a close-up image of her sleeping newborn son wearing a blue knitted hat and another of proud big brother August meeting his baby brother for the first time, Eugenie wrote, Jack and I wanted to share the news that we had our little boy, Ernest George Ronnie Brooksbank on 30th of May 2023 at 8.49 weighing 7.1 pounds. He is named after his great-great-great-grandfather George, his grandpa George and my grandpa Ronald. Augie is loving being a big brother already. Ernest, who does not have a royal title, is 13th in line to the throne behind his older brother, August. 